Um, the first thing I'd recommend doing on a problem like this, ladies and gentlemen, is rewriting this. Okay, so therefore, when you're going to go ahead and integrate this, you're going to have x to the 3 halves divided by 3 halves plus 2x. Or therefore, we can rewrite this as 2 thirds x to the 3 halves plus 2x from 0 to 4. Does everybody follow my integrating here? So I rewrote it as using a fractional exponent, Carlson. And then basically, I just took the integral, or the indefinite integral here. But I'm evaluating, so I don't need to include the c. And then dividing by 3 halves, the same thing as multiplying by 2 thirds. Um, obviously, guys, so therefore, when I multiply 2 thirds times 4 times the 3 halves plus 2 times 4 minus, if I'm doing the same thing, everything is 0, then that's just going to give me 0. So I'm not even going to fill that in because you're evaluating all for 0. Um, remember that 4 to the 3 halves is the same thing as the square root of 4 cubed. Remember how to rewrite a rational power as a, as a radical. So therefore, 4 cubed is 64. The square root of 64 is equal to 8. So therefore, you have 2 thirds times 8 plus 8. We'll write that as a fraction. You have 16 over 3 plus 8. Rewrite 8 as a fraction to be a power of 3. So multiply by that by 3. It'd be 24, 30, wait, 8, 16, 24. So your final answer would equal 40 over 3. Okay.